Tomlinson. I'm the managing director of a company by the name of CLS Performance Solutions. Uh, our primary focus is uh, delivering blended learning solutions to those organisations that have um, and need to implement large ERP business transformation type programs. So that's where we come in and help organisations improve employee performance. Our biggest challenge since starting out the business has been to find very good consultative salespeople. So if you think about what we do, it's very much project driven, it's consultative. And so what happens is um, the, the sales life cycle can take up to 12 months because you know it's not something you do every day and, and some projects can be of very high value. So finding people who could identify good opportunities and have the right networks in place to be able to help us get into those opportunities was proving to be almost impossible. We felt very comfortable with the, the approach and the model. What was very um, beneficial for us is we felt that they were part of CLS. The team who work in Durham Lane are very much together. They foster that momentum and garner the relationship. The other real point about it is I just love the methodology, that the, the, the sales methodology that's used. It works for us, it works really well. In four months, we've had 18 meetings with customers. That is unheard of in our business. What I would say is, if you know, one of your references is experiencing the same problems that we had, which is to find good consultative solutions salespeople, but needing to open doors initially, then the way that Durham Lane works can help you achieve that door opening and the discipline around follow up, you know, um, if they organize a meeting, they do it. You know, if they, if they say they're going to follow up in a week's time to do a call, they do it. That just their whole approach in understanding what the client's business problem is, how that aligns to what CLS offer, you know, and, and matching the two, they've been really helpful for us. And that, that would be what I would say to, you know, any organisation that's struggling to find good pipeline building opportunities.